Hey, I've got a Vive now, so I thought I'd update this project to support both it and the motion controllers. When you launch the game, it will run as normal on the monitor. To enter VR, just press the top button on the left controller. And this will also reset your view if you press it again. I don't have the new Oculus or the touch controllers, so I've not added support for those, but the game does work on the DK2, so hopefully it'll also run fine on the new headset. And yeah, leaving behind the Rift does make the project's name kinda odd. Anyway, the game now runs on Unreal Engine 4.15, which allows me to support VR instance stereo rendering, as well as switch from deferred to forward rendering which should give a frame rate boost. The world to meters value has been changed to 10 from 100. Since the blocks are supposed to be huge and allow you to get up real close to them. Previously, that gave bad results for the lighting due to your expectations of the scale. But this change sorted that out. And speaking of the lighting, I took inspiration from Google Earth VR and now you can grab and move the sun with the Vive grip buttons on the left controller. Or on our regular gamepad, click in the right analog stick or on the mouse, hold the middle button. To get this working on a VR motion controller, it needs to be pulled every frame as well as provide data about its location relative to the player. So you'll find that here as part of the event tick code. The version for regular controllers is here in the camera section, which has gone through a lot of changes. The changes were necessary to accommodate the new camera system that handles the new flying controls. Just point with the right motion controller and press up or down in the pad and you'll move towards or away from that direction. The flying also works with a gamepad or mouse either in VR or on a monitor but it's in the direction you're facing. Aside from that there were some other minor tweaks here and there and I also had to replace some nodes that have become deprecated since the last update. <laughs> 